NYPD is going through a mass exodus of officers leaving the force just as the city is in the middle of a violent crime wave. All right, and that includes dozens of detectives. Last month alone, Teresa Priolo has more on why they're saying enough's enough. Teresa. Stephen Lloyd, looking at the numbers, almost as many cops have resigned in the first half of 2022 than in all of 2020. This mass exodus, the result of an aging police force, but also the result of certain laws like bail reform mixed with what some officers perceive to be an anti-police climate. The search is on for the next generation of New York's finest, now that veteran cops are resigning or retiring en masse. 100 detectives retired in June alone, another 75 are expected to turn in their badges in July. Paul DiGiacomo is president of the Detectives Endowment Association. It's very disturbing. Uh, when you're losing this amount of detectives, it's, it's going to be a, a drastic uh, effect on public safety. Not just detectives. It's NYPD members of every rank. In 2020, 553 cops resigned, 2,599 retired. In 2021, 1,053 resigned, 1,654 retired. And for the first half of 2022, 497 have resigned already, 594 have retired. Michael Alcazar is a retired NYPD detective who spent 39 years on the job. My friends are showing up to jobs responding to a job to handle an assignment and they're getting flack from the community. The community, what they feel like the community doesn't appreciate them, doesn't want them there and they can't do their job. There can be no denying a market shift in sentiment toward uniformed officers throughout the pandemic. But then there's bail reform and a change in the way the DAs are handling cases. Detective Alcazar points out the officers up for retirement are also a part of a very large class. When older guys are like my age, staying to like 30 and then they're throwing them back on patrol, it's probably not good for your health for for most guys. We can't handle patrol. We're old men in our 50s. We can't go back on patrol. So age absolutely comes into uh, into the formula. The problem is not only are officers retiring, new prospects aren't signing up in equal numbers. I have students that are aspiring to be police officers. They were supposed to go in this April, this last April class. They turned it down. The res in response to this mass exodus, Mayor Adams says he's not worried about the change. He says it, it is a great opportunity to diversify the department.